hello here you can see a hydrometer and some ethanol production uh, here's a percentage about 94 95 percent it's quite cold so this is a continuous system again this one is designed for recovery of uh, ethanol if it's been used for something or with something mixed with water just industrial grade or you can call it fuel ethanol steel so here we've got a mix it's a mix of ethanol and water it could be wash mesh doesn't matter so it's for fuel purposes or like recovery of industrial alcohols here's a pump little bit of water on the floor nothing clicks nothing dribbles from this steel uh, okay what we've got here here's a water supply this video mainly for the person who I build it for this one is a water in uh, here's a water distributor here's a steam generator on this side here you can control the level of water so you can see it's jumping a bit oh, sorry. this bucket is for spent water so it's water that's getting separated from the from the wash in the final stage. It's not the wash, so technically wash runs into the system here. Yeah. The one with the red strip is a wash in, another one is waste out, so it's wasted to wash out. The first stage just gain about 40%. Here's a column, here's a heat exchanger, and from the heat exchanger it's connected with a separator, actual separator, and this separator connected with a water trap, and water trap produces water continuously, it's like a good water, you can reuse it for cooling, for, for whatever, just water. So this water is recovered from the steam and water removed from the ethanol and once the water is removed from the ethanol you've got this column you've got reflux valve here and you can control the output percentage and speed of this reflux valve everything would depend on the actual alcohol content of your mix or mesh or wash is a breathing valve and here's a breathing valve as well uh, plus here we've got a, a connection of another breather that actually reduces the pressure within the reduction uh, part of the steel where all the waste is coming out so to prevent it from any kind of uh, vacuum formation so it reduces here and it's connected with actual water trap and any fumes water vapor getting condensed in here and reduced into the bucket as well so it's water in here uh, this system is about 4.5 kilowatts okay carry on uh, sorry for mess is an overview cannot get backwards any further a lot of metal stuff behind of me can fall down anyway is a system it's a production The actual mixture is about 
uh, and I've been asking about 75% mixture to be recovered or something like that, quite high percentage anyway. This one would be capable of from 12% up to infinity. So, here's the thing. Tomorrow I'm gonna mark it, every part, disassemble and send it away.